What is going on guys? My name is Griffin and welcome to What is up guys? My name is Griffin and welcome to episode two of my Minecraft survival let's play series. Now, you probably are wondering why am I in the valley beneath my base? Why am I not in my base or in a mine or something? Well, that's because we are actually going to be terraforming this entire area. I really want a custom lake or kind of like pond that essentially elevates the water level of this entire area. I think it would look really, really good if there was you know, a pond that extended about there underneath the airship, maybe to over there, and just through here. Whoa, try not to get killed. I just wanna show you my stuff. Come through my, my reed farm, sugar cane farm, uh, and I, it would be nice if the pond extended just past the pillar that's upholding the sheep sanctuary in my base. Something maybe to about right there. So, in order to accomplish this, I am actually going to completely level an entire hill right outside my base. And I actually think that's the one that I want to take down. I'm going to get all of that dirt, all of that stone, and we are going to terraform an entire new water system underneath my bridge and around my base. So, I think it's gonna be a good time. Gotta come back and kill you for shooting me earlier. We could take the ladder, or we could not. Come out right here. First things first, we're gonna need tools. For tools, we're gonna need diamond, because why are we gonna waste our iron when we're harvesting an entire mountain. So I've got this whole stack of diamond ore that I've silk touched out, and now I've got a fortune three pickaxe. So how many diamonds do you think we can get from an entire stack if we're using fortune three? Time to find out. So I've got the replay mod on for this time lapse. I've got to see how much, uh, how many diamonds are we gonna get from an entire stack of silk touched diamond ore? So high up. Good Lord. All right, we are high above everything. This is a pretty sweet view. Maybe I should build something up here, but that's not what we're here to do right now. Right now, we mined these diamonds. And let's go. Already got one stack. That is a little over two stacks of diamonds worth. That should be more than enough to make all the tools that I need to level that mountain behind us. And obviously finally deck out my character with diamond armor because I've been struggling in this iron suit. All right, so now we're gonna come back and we're gonna stash our diamonds. And let's just grab a few. I don't know where that growling is coming from. Let's make enough for, we'll have three diamond shovels on hand. And we'll empty our inventory, not in that chest. We'll empty our inventory over here. Put our diamonds back. And it's nighttime now, so let's go to bed before we start tackling that beast. We'll just have a little shot eye in Captain's quarters, yeah? Sorry, I don't know why I did a British accent just then. And it's morning, bright and early, time to hopefully not kill that poor horsey. But we're going to take that whole mountain down probably to about there. I really want to save that horse, but I can't find my leads anywhere. This is probably why I need to get organized, because can't find anything in this base! Is 
Son of a... Where are they? Uh, there we go. Now we just gotta see if we can get you down. Get you down safely, boy. See if I can even get me up safely. Oh. Okay. Come with me. I don't have a name tag, so I can't name you yet, but you've got spots. So, we're gonna call you Spot. Come on. Stubborn, aren't you? What was that? We are just gonna have you chill out right there. That's your home now, Spot. We're gonna come up around the back end of the mountain. Die! Man. Griffin's Point looks great from up here, but this is the starting point from which we are going to level this entire mountain and use all of that dirt to make a custom lake underneath the base. I think it's gonna look really sweet when we're done. Let's roll a time lapse. All right, you guys, as you can see, it is the middle of the night and my inventory is full and that's counter to half of the goal. Half of this is about gathering the materials from this mountain in order to terraform the area below it. It's also uh, halfway about not dying. Get out of here. So, I'm gonna head back to the base real quick and offload some of these resources and also get- OH! GOD! I'm also gonna get some chests made, kinda have a little chess monster at the bottom of this in order to store all of this raw stone and dirt. So, I'll be right back. Ya yeah, mama! So while I'm looking for chests, I get a view of the mountain and I have like- Feels like I've barely made a dent in it from this angle. I'm trying to get it down to about there because I feel like that'll be a good amount of resources to work with in the level below. And it'll also kind of keep this, uh, this vista looking quite nice whenever I want to look out over it. So I've literally spent until morning looking for wood in my base and couldn't find any. So I'm just going to steal chests out of captain's quarters in my airship. And that is going to be how we continue working on destroying that mountain. All right, now that we've got what we need, let's get back to it. All right, we're about on our second or third day or night cycle working on dismantling this entire mountain to terraform the area beneath my base. And I mean, I'm finally level with about, you know, my bedroom and my blimp, <laughs> so that's progress. But let's see how far we actually have to go. Gonna offload all of our dirt and stone. Let's have a look from here, shall we? Okay. We're doing a little bit better. We're almost halfway there, I think. Still got a little bit to go. Anyway, y'all, I think that is about enough for this second episode of my Minecraft Survival Let's Play. If you're enjoying the content, feel free to give me a like, subscribe, do all that good YouTube stuff. It all helps out. I want to be doing this for a long time. It's a lot of fun. And if you think the content's enjoyable, help me stick around. So without further ado, Griffin out.